The honky tonks and other businesses downtown have hired their own private security force, and that has raised some questions about what those officers are doing. Here's News 2's My Owens. I think it's not a great model to have just anybody being able to have what amounts to a mercenary police force. Already, Metro Police has dedicated officers working to keep the peace. Now, business owners have hired their own private security force. Metro Police do a fantastic job. We're just here to support and augment them and their efforts in downtown. We first reported about this security team. Now, council members like Freddie O'Connell wonders how enforcement will work. I don't know exactly under what jurisdiction uh, this would have been allowed uh, to happen such that these officers, if that's what they are, private security professionals, could issue citations or make arrests or any of that. In this week, representatives explaining the process. If we are involved, we're going to evaluate the basis for the detention and, and citizen's arrest and determine whether or not by law we can assist mm -hmm. with that prosecution. Since then, Metro Police now telling News 2 there's been a pause on officers participating. Officials with MNPD pointing to an insurance discrepancy that needs to be worked out before they can sign up. TSU also pulling their officers, stating they're reviewing off-duty assignments, including this one. Now worry centered around what kind of arrest the security force is making. How can we know how many people that don't have an address or have an address at the mission or whatever have been arrested? Their goal is to provide resources and outreach and it is not to arrest. Still, some worry what this will mean for downtown Nashville moving forward. I don't think anybody wants to see a downtown where honky tonk owners are the ones with their own police forces, right? I think that's not that's not the direction we want to move in. And we reached out to the security firm. We were told each person that signs on has to be with a law enforcement agency. They also get specific training on how to handle arrests or citations.